Hello guys, in this video I'll be showing you how to use WordPress in HostZinger. So HostZinger allows us to host our website. This can be either a paid or there is actually a free version which is 000 web host and it's still powered by HostZinger. We'll go ahead and log in. Uh, we can either log in with Facebook or with Google. So let's go ahead and log in. Once we have logged in, this is what the panel would look like. So we can see we can create our own websites right here. We can look for a desired domain. So I'm going to go ahead and create a new website. So I'll click create new website right here. Uh, Host Zinger will then ask if this application is for a WordPress account. So we can go ahead and tick this. We can then add in an optional name. So this will be the name of the website. If that name is already taken or is not available, then it will tell you that it is not. That's why if you're looking to just get started, I will keep this optional blank. So let's go ahead and provide a password. And as you can see here, there are some security criteria that we need to meet to be able to match for our password. Once we're happy with that, let's go ahead and click create. And then we will get a pop-up right here. So this is for us to be able to access the WordPress admin. And this is the name of the URL, or this is the URL of our newly generated website so let's go ahead and create a password once again and let's go ahead and choose our language so we'll put this into english and then this will then install wordpress within hostinger and let's go ahead and click install so this might take a while, so we'll go ahead and wait for this. And there you go. So we have installed WordPress within HostSinger. So this will be our dashboard within HostSinger and allows us to do so many things that we want for our website. So we can go into the website itself. We can, you know, learn the code, earn money. We can go to files, selecting different domains, emails, databases, and other things as well. And as you can see, there are some limited options as well as they are in premium only. Now, if we want to see the website that we have generated, we can do so by clicking on, on the website itself right here. And as you can see, this is our WordPress website already generated using Hostinger. So as you can see here, it's powered by WordPress. And there you go. We have now generated our WordPress account using Hostinger and using the free version, which is 000 web host. Well, I hope that you have found this tutorial useful. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe. And we will see you next time.